hello everyone. Welcome to the uh, evening world of Seven Days to Die. Uh, we're we're here. This is the same. This is the evening of the of the previous. The same day as before. Uh, nothing too much has happened. I did a bit of reorganization and all that sort of stuff. But um, w a f I've done a few things. Let's see. I made some spotlights, industrial lights, and warehouse outdoor lights. Uh, I've got some switches. And, you know, <coughs> I've been thinking about... Uh, oh, and I got some relays. <laughs> I've been thinking about a couple of things. And one of them is, I think that um, running lights during the day is kind of silly. And I'm thinking I might just automate lights. So, uh, time... Is, there's a timer relay. And I'm thinking the timer relay would be a nice uh, addition uh, to the, the whole spotlight warehouse industrial light thing. And so I'm going to craft one. Now I need, what do I need? I need forged iron, which I have. Electrical and electronic. Okay. Electrical and electronic. Actually, that was electronic and electrical, but we're not going to, to uh, you know. <laughs> All right. So um, I'm going to make, I'll make one for now. Not favorite. Oh my goodness. What am I missing? Oh, oh, I don't have the skill. Oh. Well, let's take a look at skills. I've been accruing skills without uh, using them, so that's kind of cool. Um, so let's say relay. No. Elec. I've got electricity basics. Switches. Oh, there's the weakness. So that's where, okay, there we go. Electric timer relay, trigger plate, and trigger plate one times five. So we're going to buy that. And then motion sensor. What the hey? Why not? Yeah, actually, you know, the motion sensor might be a good idea for uh, firing up the, whatchamacallits, the, uh, the blade traps. Hmm. I'm going to have to think about that. So, all right. So, that means we can now make our timed relay. Uh, there we go. And... Uh, I'm going to just grab, oh, let's grab these and these. And also, uh, our ammo is ready, so we're going to put that away in the, uh, hmm, how are we going to organize our ammo here? Ah, uh, this is good enough. Uh, we'll put you there, and, oh, of course. I already had a pile of 7.62, so we'll keep 39 on us, just because, right? Uh, yeah, I have the uh, sniper rifle on me, so it's, it's, it's nice to have some... Uh, uh, I, I need the ammo for it, so there you go. All right. Oh, why do I have steel? Put those away. All right. There we go. Um, yeah. So, timer relay. Okay, is it? How's it? Oh, it's already made. Yeah. Okay, good. So I think what we're gonna do. I have to. I have to. Uh, it is nighttime, and I thought this was a good time to work on lighting. Um, it's a little dark in this corner. Oh. There's uh, some sparking going on. Yeah, that's kind of interesting. But I, I, I have to think about how I'm going to organize all my electrical stuff. So I'm thinking that what I'll do... Actually, let me turn on my headlight. Is I'm going to start with uh, working on the lighting. Um, because uh, that way I can keep all this stuff running. Because uh, as you know, I don't have any spikes. The only protection I have for my base right now is uh, the electric fence and the blade trap. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, and everything looks like it's going well. Excellent. Okay. Now, relay. So, lighting. I have to think about where I'm going to put lighting. Uh, I have to think about... Oh, hey, everybody! <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> Oh, that worked really well. Hi. Come on in. Welcome. Yes. Yes. If you would like to end it all, just uh, head this way. <laughs> oh, poor. There we go. <laughs> oh, gee. Did somebody still got... Oh, no, that was a... Uh, okay. Oh, unfortunately, I'm going to lose corpses, aren't I? Hmm. Okay, let's... Uh, oh, thank you. Oh, that's lovely. That's right. 
And you, and... Can I get you? Oh, you're... Are you still there? <laughs> <laughs> Apparently he was still there. He just couldn't do anything with his... Oh. Putrid girl. Okay, let's... Okay, this is a good test. Let's see what happens with crawlers. Uh, with that electric fence. Good. Oh, excellent. Oh, working as expected. Nice, nice. Oh, but you're crawling under the electric fence. Oh, uh, hello. Here, let's do this one. And there we go. All right, so, uh, and how, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. How's the uh, blade trap? 1,500. Yeah, that, that took 500 out of that whole thing, so... I'm going to, uh, I'm, uh, during a horde, I'm going to have to keep on top of repairing that sucker. That's for darn sure. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, that was a nice little test. Uh, how are you? You're good. How are you? You're good. And you're good. Yeah. Excellent. Uh, let's put away some of our, actually, do I have, oh, wow. I've got a lot of crap in here. I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to sort all that out. Um. Let's grab you. Actually, we've got a full inventory, so let's do this. There we go. And then uh, we'll put away the duct tape. And we've got ourselves a nice suit jacket just in case we get invited by the neighbors for, uh, you know, an outing. You never know. Could be possible. All right. Uh, oh, 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 yes. Also, I only have one forge running just to try to keep the heat down. And I'm using it to... Uh, uh, pump out iron bars because I am going to need a lot of iron bars. So we're going to do this and up. Oh, of course, I yeah. Uh, how, why would I need two stacks? That doesn't make any sense. Uh, let's do this. And there we go. All right. <coughs> now, back to the task at hand. Lighting. So I... One of the things I have to do is figure out this, the organization for the lighting. Uh, we have uh, what, we, what I would uh, call a spaghetti organization at the moment. Um, this is not really a, a great uh, organization system. It's um, actually what you would probably consider a terrible organization system. So let's, let's try to do this methodically. All right, lighting is not typically something that is done on the main floor, right? Lighting is typically done uh, e from the, this floor here, or we could even route lighting. Let's close you up from the roof, and basically then from here down to there, and then from here down to there, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So there's a, a few things to think about here. Now I'm thinking what we're going to do is put the. Now let's open you up. I'm going to put the relay for the lighting. Uh, in here, uh, and and then we're gonna it'll it'll go up through the roof. Uh, let's take a look at what we got here. Let's grab the um, that candle and that candle, and I think we could put let's put that right there. Okay, so that's the timer for the lighting, and then uh, let's put our candles back because otherwise it's it's kind of dark down here. And it's you, you, and you, and oh, oh, and oh, yeah, you don't have one. There we go. All right. So that's the relay for the for the lighting for the down uh, for for uh, uh, yeah. That's the, the the lighting relay. And I'm thinking what I'm going to do is uh, hmm. Essentially, it's above here, right? So let's put another. Now I let's put a switch uh, down here, like this. Can I rotate you? No, I can't. Hmm. Like that, and then we're gonna hook up wires to it. So you, uh, we're gonna hook directly from the uh, the generator. And we're going to go right to this switch. Now, it is going through the wall a little bit, but that's not too bad. Wait a minute. Oh. Well, unlike most switches, 
things go in. <laughs> okay, well, I'm not going to worry about it then. <laughs> Usually, in the light switch, <laughs> it's like, uh, you know, that's the scissor, uh, the scissor uh, breaker, and there's an in and an out or whatever. But <laughs> uh, these are these are these are fancy switches that you know that doesn't that's not how they operate. So let's go up here like this and connect to you. There we go. It's a little bit ugly, but it's not super terrible. So that's fine. And then uh, I'm thinking what I'm going to do is, let's see. Let's put you down. <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. All right. And then essentially, uh, okay, so the, the relay is right up below this one. So I think what we'll do is we'll take a, the timed relay. So I'm going to put a relay right there. And then uh, what I'll what that allow me to do. By the way, um, there's been some discussion about you know you can use switches instead of relays and stuff, and that's true. Um, I'm not going to argue that. I I like organizing things in a certain way. Uh, I like the idea of relays, uh, and if they cost something, let's see. There we go. So that's going to control power up to the top there. Um, but if I I like relays. I, I, I like the idea behind them. Oh, and they do... Uh, okay, good. They take uh, space, so that's fine. All right, now. Here's where things get interesting. Uh, so now we've got to figure out how we're going to organize uh, the relays as far as uh, lighting is concerned here. Now, I'm, I'm thinking, and this is a bit... Yeah, I'm going to do the same basic ideas that I did in the other one. So what we're going to do is uh, come over here. No, what did I just do? I'm just playing this by ear, by the way. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, I think what we're going to do is we're going to have uh, you here. Or, yeah, we're going to have you here. What? Oh, oh, okay. And then I'm going to... Uh, now, I could do this in a number of different ways. You know what? I'm going to do it the, yeah, the other way. All right. I'm going to put one here. And that's over the... Oh, oh, is that not over the middle? Oh, crap. And let's pick you up. Okay, that's probably the middle. And then we're going to go over here. And you can go there. And you can go there. All right. I think that's good. Okay, so let's head on in and go on up. And then essentially what I'm going to do is hook those bad boys up to this, uh, this relay here. And we're just going to go... Like that, and what, what, what did I just do? Okay, no, I got turned around there for a sec, and then to there, and now this one's going to go through the, the thing, so it's kind of ugly, but uh, we're going to have to live with it, so that's fine, see, like that, and then this one here is going to go to this one here. All right, so... There we go. So that's the, uh, those are the distribution points. Okay, so these are the, this is the, these are the, this is going to supply lighting for this side of the base, and then that one for that side, that one for that side, that one for that side. Uh, I don't know. It, I think it'll work fine. But, uh, okay, let's take a look. So I want the start time to be, um, no, let's go backwards. Can we go backwards? Oh, we can. So I'm thinking uh, 2100, so an hour before sundown, and then we want it to turn off at, what am I doing? Good grief. Let's say uh, an hour after sunrise. Now, we can always adjust this, right? So uh, at, uh, basically at yeah, 9, it'll turn on, and at 5 in the morning, it'll turn off. So there we go. So. That should be going. And then uh, let's take a look at what we've got here. We've got, uh, oh, I already grabbed them. Okay, the first is, uh, 
spotlights. I think the spotlight should f shine out this way. Now, the other op choice is to shine spotlights out this way, but really, this base is designed for to to be the welcoming arms. This is the fr this is the friendship base. In this friendship base, we have welcoming arms greeting our zombies in. Uh, even if they come from that way, they should come in like this. Even if they come from that way, they should come like this. So anything that's from in this 90 degree arc should be coming event in like this. That's the whole point. So that if I'm here or behind the, the blade, that's how they should come in. And if they're coming from over here, they go that way. So uh, I think that it makes sense to put the uh, spotlight uh, right above right here. So I think that's what we're going to do. Now, the big question, of course, is can I do that? I don't know. Um, let me see here. Did I bring... Yeah, there they are. <coughs> you know what I might do? Um, I have some concrete mix on me. Actually, uh, yeah, let's do the concrete mix. Um, wet concrete. Let's take a look at our shapes. We could use the arch. The arch would be particularly nice. Uh, the ramp would be nice too. I think I'm gonna use an arch. So let's do four arches. And let's put the wiring tool. No, actually we'll put the, uh, there we go. And we'll put you there. Okay. Now, I I'm thinking that the arch can be over the, uh, like that. Okay, like that. And then I'm going to hope, and I don't know if this is going to work, but can I... Oh. Okay. And then can I... And... Let's do targeting. Okay. Uh, okay. And then I can't remember how I... Wait a minute. How do I get into the camera preview again? There is a way of... You must power this component to use the camera function. Oh, okay. Let's power you up. Do you not have juice? Why don't you have juice? Oh, just hush up. Oh, this is a good time as any. Okay, so uh, I don't really understand... Hey guys, welcome, welcome everybody. Oh, did I disconnect? Hmm. Oh no. So it's coming from here to there. Is it? Is it because of the relay? Uh, the relay is not drawing any power. Oh. Start time. Oh, I know why. Because it is it possible that it hasn't it it it, it won't work until the next twenty one hundred hours. Hmm. That's kind of noisy out there. So, what time is it? Uh, twenty two, twenty two, two twenty two. So let's do this. Uh, we'll go to two thirty. Right, and that's uh, almost imme imminent, imminently, and then we'll go up here, and uh, we've got our uh, spotlight, and I can turn it on or off, no, okay, so now it's on, and presumably at 2.30 it should turn on, because that, well, I'm just guessing here, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, just be quiet. We're we're working up here. This is important business. Okay. It didn't work. All right. So what am I doing wrong? Is it be, is it now powered? Power this component. You guys are probably like, dude, you didn't do X, Y, or Z. And I'm like, yeah, I know. I don't actually need this relay. I can actually just hook up directly from this relay to there. But uh, I want to be able to power other lights from here, so I need uh, that relay to be down so I can connect to other things. So, What's going on down there? Is one of... Uh, here, I think we've got a problem. Uh, refined. All right, let's go and take a look. 
Oh, I need mechanical parts. I am running out of inventory space. So they make noise when they're damaged. Eh, that's good to know. And you're good too. Okay, sweet. All right, we can put away our uh, uh, these guys. Okay, so again, let's okay, let's let's check our wiring from top to bottom because I've I've screwed up something. Uh, all right, so from the generator to this. Oh, for crying out loud. <laughs> oh, that's just awesome. <laughs> okay, and... Oh, you were on. Okay. There we go. And now I can... Um, no, 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 no. Uh, do the targeting. Okay. And I want to target essentially into the base like this. So there we go. That's good, right? Right on the edge of the concrete. Uh, escape. Oh, that worked. There we go. Look at that. Whoa ho ho. Ho ho. Now I can turn off my headlight. Oh. Oh. You know what? No, I got a better idea. We're gonna take you. This is uh we got we have we have a better plan and don't I have to remember to to redo the relay because I set the time to a Gibby time, so we're gonna do that as well. Um, let's grab you, and uh, before you uh, cure, let's uh, take you out. I got a better idea. This is uh this should be interesting. I've been waiting for an opportunity, so I've got lead, glass. And I want to make um, a glass, bulletproof glass. Is there an arch? Oh, I have to use a ramp, do I? I could use a plate. A glass plate, not centered. Let's do, uh, let's do bulletproof. Okay, so we've got a block, a curved plate. Curved plate's not bad. Okay, let's try a curved plate and see how that looks. It's going to... Uh, oh, no, not two. Let's craft one. And uh, let's do that. And uh, and I think we're going to try a plate. I think that the plate is actually the more interesting one. So we're going to do this. We're going to try the plate, and we'll see how that works. Uh, I should probably test it using a uh, wood plate, but... I'm going to I'm going to throw caution to the wind. While that's uh cooking off, we're going to take a look in our relay. And I'm going to set that back to turning on at 2100 hours. There we go. And then we're going to come back here and oh, almost. Come on. Oh. Wow. Who knew it took so long to make bulletproof glass? In the meantime, I want to grab these bars. There. <laughs> Not wasting my time. I grabbed the bars. All right. So Let's uh, let's put the um, the the arch. There we go. Let's put you in there under uh, other bad ideas, in our bad idea place. Um, okay. Now what I want to do is something like uh, advanced rotation. Yeah, that right there. And then, if I could put the uh, put you up there like that and then we can hook you up like this and like this there we go and then we can go to the targeting and take a look and then we can oh yeah oh yeah that worked oh ho, 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 that's much better sweet okay and then we go like right there and we hit escape yeah oh yeah look at that isn't that that's like magic it's like magic in fact, if I was smart, what I would do is I would put, um, to protect this light, I would encase it in bulletproof glass. And that would protect it from uh, doing bad things. It does appear that the bulletproof glass does do a little bit, um, is it, does it have some shadowing? I'm not really sure. But, oh hey, no worries, that is, that is awesome. Okay, 
So now you, uh, we're gonna we're gonna pick you up. Um, take, because uh, I want to redo all these lights, these little industrial lights. They're uh, I don't like where I put them. So we're gonna grab all these little industrial lights. Uh, oh 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 oh. Okay, actually, before we do that, go do that too much. Let's get. Um, Let's get the uh, more glass plates being made. Let's make, um, let's see, uh, I need three plus, well, let's do, um, let's do 11. There we go. Good morning. <laughs> All right, so let's grab you. Day 27, we got two days. We've got two days to get ourselves fully ship shape and, and, and ready for the, the horde. I think we're going to make it. Um, I just wanted to get lighting sorted out. Okay. There we go. I think we've got all of those lights. Now, the big question is what to do with those industrial lights. Because those industrial lights aren't too bad. Uh, I just don't think that they were placed in the best position. In the meantime, uh, let's take a look at how our... We've got a glass plate. Let's grab that, and we can do our other... You know what? We need to be able to see what's going on. So I'm going to temporarily change this to, like, noon or something like that. There we go. Okay. What I could do, actually, is... You know what? I'm going to... We're going to do a trick. Oh, I don't know if this is going to work, though. Yeah, I'm not going to do it. Um, I was going to put a uh, switch in parallel with this relay so that I could manually override whether or not the relay is turning on things or not. But I think we're just going to leave it. Um, once we get the lights sorted out, uh, it'll be fine. So let's see. Oh, I think I'm almost walking off the side of my building here. Okay, now, where did I put that? No, not you. Uh, okay, the block above the door. So the block above the window, or not the, oh, yeah, uh, right, oh, yeah, actually, let's just do this. Copy, and there, oh, is that it? Yeah, okay. And then we can place the light up there, like that. And then we can connect it. There, like that. And then we can target you. Uh, same basic targeting, based something like this. There we go. And there we go. Nice. Okay. And then we're going to do the same over here. But uh, let me see. Do we have any more plates? We've got three plates. Awesome. Okay. And then I think what we'll do is we will... Uh, let's do that again. Uh, let's go here and do... Uh, copy. And right over the door. Like that. And... No! Oh! That's terrible. Oh, that makes me sad. Can I? I can't. I can't pick you up. No. Oh, that's just. That, it breaks. It breaks my heart a little bit. I. I messed that up. That was. That was all me. <laughs> At least we can see now. We can see how tough it is. Okay. So let's put you and connect you. There we go. And then uh, we can take a look at your targeting and point you right right there like that sweet okay and then we're gonna do one more even though I I, 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 I didn't oh man I screwed that up okay we've got three of you and then let's go here and let's uh, 
Okay, copy. And I think this is pretty cool. I'm 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 really liking the way that this is set up. So uh, let's put you there. Not not try try not to screw it up this time. And then take you and put you here, like that. And okay. Like. And there we go. All right. Awesome. Okay. So I think that that's pretty good. Um, that, as far as the spotlights are concerned, I think we're in good shape. In fact, I want to go and take a look at what that looks like from a distance. Yeah. Look at that. Uh, it's, that's perfect. It lights up this whole welcome the this whole welcome mat where we greet our our undead friends to the to the their their end and we we help them cross over to the other side because you know that's what we're here for. We're we're here to help, right? Yeah, that that's sweet. I love the 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 bulletproof glass for that. That is just that's just amazing. Okay. All right. So do 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 and oh yeah look at that look at that that's i am really happy with the way that turned out oh man let's go take a look at the other one do, 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 do. don't run into the cactus because the cactus is gonna hurt i also like the fact that it doesn't blind you anymore when you look into it yeah that is sweet okay and this one. Yeah. Okay, that works just great. So I'm happy with that. I think that um, <coughs> that is uh, that is awesome. Okay. Actually, before we continue too far, we have to think about one thing. We have to think about what to do with the uh, industrial lights. Because I do want the industrial lights. I do like them. And I think they can be useful. But I have to figure out what we're going to do with them. Uh, so let's put the bulletproof, bulletproof glass away. Oh, look at that. I got a bunch of broken glass. Oh, yeah, from the... Yeah, okay. I also made outdoor lights just for kicks and giggles because I wanted to see how they worked. And where did I put them? Oh, there they are. I got a ton of these industrial lights now. Um, I could put them out on the ends here. They're a bit exposed underneath the turret. Uh, unfortunately, this this design will not does not lend well to uh, because of the way that I'm you know it's using the um, uh, it's taking up that entire block so that's not great um, and of course it does the same there so that's not great either uh, I could put them off to this no so yeah see this whole design that's the problem because of the way that everything the way the the blocks are placed it. You're going to end up with like a floating light, and that's that's just uh, that is a terrible, terrible thing that no one should have to live with. Okay. Hmm. Um, like I could put them under here, just to show. Yeah, it's not too bad. How much power do these things take? I don't really know. And the other question is, uh, can I reach the uh, that relay all the way out to here, or would I have to put in interim relays? That is another question. You know what? Let's try it. We can always pick it up. Let's put one there. Let's put. We're. I am investigating all this stuff as much as anything. I. I don't know. I don't know the answers to these questions. Oh, you know what? We're gonna do. Uh, oh, we have to do this side first. Shoot. Okay. Let's go like this, and then like this. Oh, oh, come on, come on. Let's make it, make it, make it, make it. No, it can't, it can't do it. It's too long. So that red. Okay. <sighs> that is a bummer. That is a bummer. All right, well. Uh, we can't put them there, so that's fine. Let's pick. Let's pick that up. Uh, I don't want to put too many relays down. I think that that's. If 
I, in order to, to, to support that out there, I'd have to put another relay down and all of that, and I'm really trying to avoid putting too many relays up. So the only thing I can, I know what we'll do. This is, this is, this will work. So, um, and it's not really apparent, here, I'm going to turn off my, uh, no, I'll leave the headlight on. It's not really, uh, I'll tell you why. It's not apparent in the daytime, but, so, okay, so this is a highly focused light, right? It lights up this area right here. But I think we need to light up, let's light up here. And did I do that at the top? I did. Um, no. No, 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 it's too far up. Uh, I need to think about this more. So we're going to put it here. And here. And here. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is this will work. That texturing is uh, bothers me, by the way. Is that right there? I see it ev all the time in my in my screenshots, and I just I see it, and it it just it drives me up the wall. Fun pimps. Okay, <laughs> there you go. I don't often complain, but that one it does. It's kind of a, it's kind of naggy, and it it does bother me. So there we go, and then we can take you and go to there. There we go, and then we take you and there and ah, oh, this is turning out. This is turning out awesome. I'm using the. No, no, not that one. Okay. I'm using the awesome word again. Okay. And there. And but I'll tell you, I. Okay, a little, a little, uh, little information about Mr. Ono. Um, Mr. Ono Koho. Uh, my education is in electronics, circuit design, all that kind of stuff. So, um, I do enjoy this. This to me is. Um, oodles of fun uh, and it's why I, uh, I it's one of the reasons why I feel strongly about things like oh I like the idea of relays <laughs> and, and I like the and I point out that's not how scissor switches work <laughs> but anyways uh, well, uh, well, uh, I won't say anything more about it than that but um, I think this is good so now we've basically lit up uh, our inside here I think that's gonna light help that's gonna help light it up it's not gonna be perfect um, and then I can pr maybe think about other things. So now, now that we've got, um, all right. So what have we got? We've got all of the spotlights that I think I'm going to want uh, turned uh, uh, turned on. All of the industrial lights that I think we're going to want turned on. We've got uh, one layer of electric fence plus another one. Oh no, that's not hooked up yet. Plus four blade traps. So now, this is where we go and we go. Okay, given all of that. How's our power consumption? Not, <coughs> excuse me, not terrible. I do need more engines. I will have to get more engines. But for now, um, we are, we have, you know, a little bit to spare here. We have essentially 50 watts to play with. Now, what I can't remember is how much each electric fence takes up. Uh, um, let's take a look. Is it obvious? Five watts. So that means that uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So eight per layer. Right, five times eight is forty. So if I hook up uh, an, uh, these guys, that is essentially another uh, forty watts. So I still have ten watts to spare, unless I get another engine. So, yeah, um, not sure. Not sure what I'm going to do. All right. Um, I think that we're almost we're almost done with this one, but I think there's one more thing that I want to look at, and it's been discussed. I've mentioned it before. Uh, I need to figure out what to do about these fence posts. 
uh, as far as uh, you know, I'd falling into there and getting stuck and all of that. Oh, by the way, yes. Um, oh, no, not you. Do I have... No, I don't have any cobblestone on me. I have to go around and replace all this cobblestone and stuff with... Uh, and flagstone with proper stuff. So once I get more secure... And I'll do that at the same time that I go around and I upgrade all these things, which will be very, very soon. All right. So uh, also, if the 40 plus, uh, presumably I might need more relays. But I'm not really sure. I mean, I could do this. There. Now that one's powered, I think. Yes. I'm pretty sure it's powered. So, yeah. <laughs> so I have to protect myself here, and I have to protect myself here. Now, uh, I've, my inventory is trash right now, so I think what we're going to do is... Um, uh, let's just use the dump chest. Okay. Uh, you can go and... Um, I want to keep that. Uh, all the electronic relays and stuff. I think we're done with that for now. So uh, I'm going to put uh, you and you and not you. Uh, the li this light. We'll have to... I'll have to think about what I want to do with that light. But for now, we don't have enough... Uh, we don't have enough stuff. So let's grab you and maybe do that and... Uh, construction. Oh, I've got bullets on me, too. Oh, nice. Okay. Um, I think we can put our bits and bobs away. So, yeah, we've got all of them there. I am going to have to go on another run. We are going through them. Eventually, I will have to go in, uh, because I need, elect I need mechanical parts, and I need uh, steel in order to repair the blade traps, which apparently, as far as I can tell, is going to be a constant thing. So, oh, a battery bank. What does it take to make a battery bank? I have to learn the battery bank. Do I need to... Uh, can I learn that myself, or do I have to learn that from somewhere else? It cannot be bought. It's a schematic. Okay, so I have to buy that probably from the trader. Okay, good to know. Excellent. All right, no worries then. Uh, okay, so where was I? <laughs> I was trying to figure out what to do with the um, uh, those uh, little thingamabobbers, so that's okay. Okay, I think what we're going to do is we're going to test it, prototype this in wood. Um, I want to take a look, so let's see what we've got. Uh, let's see what we've got uh, available to us. Um... I'm thinking I might actually want to build whatever I build in wood. Uh, wood plate would probably be a, a, a good thing. Um, a wood railing might be nice. Uh, a sign. <laughs> it doesn't have to be great. It just has to exist. Let's try a wood railing and uh, let's see how that looks. Seven. So um, if I put, I can't put that. You know what? We don't need you. Here, I should be using the right tool for the job. I don't need the bottom w the bottom one. I can basically just put that there like that. And I can get in and out. And I can still get here. So let's do uh, another wood railing. Let's do another one. Oh, I made two. That's fine. Um, we're not, nobody's perfect. There we go. Now, eh, 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 eh. But I can still see it. And all of that sort of stuff. Can I upgrade the wood railing? No, I can't. But it's good enough. It, it keeps me out of there. Uh, I'd have to physically jump. In fact, I could put a... Um, can I do advanced rotation on wood railings? I can. Ha <laughs> ha so I, it, I could replace these with, with plates. In fact, uh, eventually. Now, I can't reach that right now. Oh. How about a hatch? No, a wooden hatch. Mm. 
Uh, I want it to face that way. And then I can upgrade you. Oh! -ho -ho! There we go. All right, that'll, that'll work. Um, really what it boils down to, though, is I could make these this railings out of anything. Um, I could make I could do iron bars here. Uh, of course, you can't do anything through iron bars. I could put in the cement. Uh, let's take a look at what we have for wet cement to our choices. Um, I could put in a really actually. You know what? What is protecting me? Oh, this is awesome. I got an idea. That is the wrong tool for that job. I got an idea. Uh, wet cement. One eighth block. Yeah. <laughs> uh, one eighth block. Two of them. And then a hatch. Wood. One. Okay. Advanced rotation, of course. Oh, I had it too. No, that sucks. No, 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 no. It's too big. Too big. Oh, dang it. No. Terrible. Awful idea. Stop. <laughs> Oh, quarter block. Oh, did I do? That was one eighth inch. A one eighth block, right? Um, pole. I know this isn't very exciting, but really, I mean, this is when when you guys aren't looking. This is the kind of stuff that I do. I just sort of stare at the at the shapes and and I ask the shapes. Shape. Do you have a good one? Do you have a good option for me, shapes? All right, we're just gonna do this. No, not that. I, I, that's fine. The, I was trying to come up with something that would allow me to see the state and be able to repair it, but because there's a hatch cover, I can still do it. So there we go. We're just doing this. We're just gonna do this, and uh, I'll leave it raw concrete. I won't upgrade it to to the reinforced stuff like that, and. Like that, and then we take our hatch and we put our hatch over it, and like this, and then we upgrade you. Oh, ho! okay, that'll work. It's not great. Uh, I'm not entirely impressed with it, but it'll do, right? And there we go. There we go. So, yeah, that that's fine. And then I think we'll finish this off by taking a look at one more thing. First of all, oh yeah, oh it's working. Oh, oh yeah, oh, that's very electrifying. Okay, so uh, that is a little exposed. Unfortunately, I can't do anything about it because of the way that's designed. I'd have to remove uh, those fence posts and, and that, yeah, these two fence posts, which I might, you know what, I could do that. Hmm. At the very least, I could do this one. Yeah, let's do this one. Do, 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 do. Oh, no, no, no. No. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Oh, uh, we're going to use a hatch. It's, if you're wondering why I do the wooden hatches, it's because you can actually see their orientation. Uh, let's do advanced rotation. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, that's good. Yeah, I can live with that. There we go. Oh. 
I have steel on me, don't I? No, 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 no. I don't want one of those out here. But there you go. Uh, let's let's do. S okay, 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 okay. Let's see how far I can upgrade that without steel on me. Uh, let's put the steel away. I have uh, forged iron. I don't mind I, as long as I don't go to the steel behemoth uh, vault, uh, the hatch thing. I don't care. There we go. That's beautiful. See, that now has... Let's take a look at what it's got. It's got a thousand. That's probably down to the first layer, so... There we go. Okay. that's That'll work. And then when I want to fix it... Ha ha ha! Ha ha! That should at least keep the cop spit off of it. This might get destroyed, but that's okay. Um, I could do the same thing over here. So essentially, I could do... Get rid of you... Yeah, I think this will work. Like this, and then we go with the uh, wooden hatch. And then we place you... Oh, come on. I can't really see. Is the hinge on the back? I think it is. Oh, it is! Oh, oh, beautiful! See, now I can... I can actually see it to repair it, so that's sweet. And then we do that, and then we go, no! Oh, I want to do that anyways, that's fine. There we go, so there's our little uh, bunker for our electric fence, and yeah, that's a, that'll, I think that'll work great. So, perfect, and I can basically, I'll repeat that for this one as well. So, and we'll, but really, I mean, that's, this is end game right here. I could probably survive the day day 28 ho horde with just doing, uh, just leaving it uh, the way it is here. And uh, uh, that's not really priority. What is priority is, uh, this is an, ex by the way, this is a prime example of why I didn't want to upgrade all of this yet. Because I needed to, like, be able, I needed to remove those crossbars in order to uh, be able to get at that. Now, the downside to this whole thing is that that is a bit exposed. Um, we'll have to see how that works out because really they, the zombie, they could, a the zombies could actually get at me quite easily by just ripping through the, that, that little barrier here, that hatch barrier. And I wonder if they'll target it because I had to remove some of these, th that crossbar in order to put that there. And that's a too high block. I'm not sure, to be honest with you. It's not actually too high because this is in the bottom, this one here. Like this this one here is in that bottom block. This one here is for this block here. So that's like almost too high, right? This is filling that. <sighs> all right, well, we're gonna have to, you know what? We're gonna leave all of them fine and I'm gonna do, I'm gonna leave this here and we're gonna maybe see if the, if the zombies target hatches because they do target doors. Do they target hatches? I don't know. Okay. I think that's good. Uh, yeah, we're going to leave it here for now. So I think we've made some really good progress. Look at that. Look at that. We've got all the lights. Let there be light. Part two. Because I called uh, a previous episode Let There Be Light. Let There Be Light. And this is another Let There Be Light. But this is Let There Be Even More Light. <laughs> all right. Thank you very much, everyone. Until next time, you all have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye.